want to switch gears for a second, Kevin, get away from that Knicks Cavs game, but talk about something else going on in the NBA. And just because your father was a longtime executive for the Green Bay Packers, very prestigious position. Magic Johnson is now taking over as president of basketball operations for the Lakers. He's been getting some criticism from those who are skeptical that he's going to rise to the occasion just because you've seen what it takes to do that job well. What will be Magic's biggest obstacle in getting the Lakers back to relevance? That's a good question, Maggie. I, I think it's got to be 24-7 uh, complete immersion into the position. It, it, it cannot require anything less. And the good GMs in this league are basketball 24-7. Not that ma Magic isn't, but Magic has got a lot of businesses going on. I mean, a lot. And that's how he has handled his post-playing time, uh, you know, from, from a, a great Hall of Fame career in the league. Uh, can, can he push all these things aside and concentrate solely on what it takes to make that Laker team better? They've already made one deal, and they, they sent Lou Williams to Houston. Um, uh, they probably had a chance for DeMarcus Cousins. I'm not sure how serious that was. Obviously, that didn't go through as he goes to the Pelicans. Um, that team needs, I, I think, everything that Magic can, can offer, and I think he's got to surround himself with good people. All these decisions are not just one person. They're a collection of people that you have around you. You look at the best GMs, they've got the strongest, deepest front offices, the scouts here in the uh, country and overseas. Uh, they've got people that are in the analytics side, but they've got many voices in that room that are offering opinion. And, and can Magic, who I'm certain can, you know, listen to these voices, process everything, because at the end of the day, he'll have to pull the trigger. But will he surround himself with all the people that maybe remain from Mitch Kupchak when he was there for such a long time as the GM? And can Magic give his full attention to this team? He loves the team. He loves the organization. Uh, he's right now in the spotlight, and the biggest – platform he's had since he retired uh, my guess is he can but that i think will be a challenge initially for him